There are two men that approach Jesus in Matthew chapter 8 that we can learn a lot from. The first one was a scribe. He worked in the Jewish religious system. And he comes to Jesus, obviously, with somewhat of a changed heart. And he says, I'll follow you wherever you go. Jesus says, you better think about that first because I don't always have a place to put my head that's comfortable at night. I don't have a building headquarters. I don't have all of the things that you would expect. He says, we live day to day, moment to moment, hour to hour sometimes. You know what's interesting is it doesn't tell us whether that scribe continued to follow Jesus or not. The second man was one of the disciples who was already connected to Jesus. He wasn't one of the apostles, he was one of the disciples. And he said, can I take some time off? I need to go bury my dad. And Jesus said, let the dead bury the dead. Now, you can interpret that a lot of different ways, but what he's really saying is, you have responsibilities in this world. Don't let them distract you and make a different priority in your life than serving in the kingdom of God. You see, we can fulfill our responsibilities when they're prioritized correctly. But many times we see a responsibility, a task, a job that we feel we need to do or that we think we need to do. And Jesus is saying, hey, if you put me first, if you're really willing to lay the priorities out the way they're supposed to be, that'll all get taken care of. Now, when we think about this, we can learn an awful lot about how to live day by day in the kingdom of God, serving Christ the way he's called each of us to do.